the story of this team. They're seven, eight, and nine hitters, some of the best in Major League Baseball this year. Day evening in Chicago. 1 0 to Simeon is lifted out towards center, and Luis Robert smash to left out of Benintendi who has a kick away briefly. Adolis Garcia, who's had a monster season as well, he's the team leader in home runs. Others. And he's been much better on the road. Kind of feels like it right now as there's a first pitch strike to Jonah Heim, the catcher, who's had a marvelous year. Two and two. And it's still two balls, two strikes to Jonah Heim. Game. Wave and a miss on a slider. One gone. If you. A couple years as a Sox. His career high in the majors, Tanner Banks, in terms of pitch count is 60. Foul ball that sounded solid. And Young whisks. Just have found themselves an everyday third. Josh Young played for Tim Tadlock at Texas Tech. He was a first round with Eloy Jimenez for a while now. Jake Berger and his family got to know Brady today. And there's Brady. Nick at his major league career has thrown in all of two games for a total of three and two thirds. To right field, driving Frazier back to the track and the wall and Breaking stuff so far. Line to left. Ben Intendi's going to have to play it on a hop. Tony Beasley waves around. But that is that's the epitome of what a third base coach's job is. A little bit up, three and two. All one strike. Team coverage of Barry concludes <laughs> with this foul ball. No, nope, no, it doesn't. <laughs> Wide range of chapeaus in the crowd, by the way. A lot of swing and miss so far for Padilla. The breaking ball is a good one. They call it a swing. Fastball away. The fastball has really been predominantly a setup pitch. On the scoreboard, Alex Verdugo just tripled with the bases loaded. Attention to Chicago sports fans, NBC. Tough stretch right now for the Sox. But Minnesota lost. Mike, thank you so much. You were talking about that fastball from Heaney. Yeah, the reason. Of average, damage-wise, against both sides of pitchers. Here he pops up to Andrews. Line to left, Benintendi on the move to make the catch. Was a pivot he might have seen out of the corner of his eyes. Simeon coming off second. And 2 and 0. Yeah, I, this he, might be a pitch around. He's absolutely pitching around. Low. Takes just outside. Didn't miss by much, but it was a touch to lefty lefty. You're going to get your fastball. It's ball four. It had extra run on it. Missed outside, and the bases are loaded. Out. Right side base hit. One run home, guard out. I mean, that was that was well thought out. The execution wasn't. There's with two out. Brock Burke, who was born in Chicago, moved to third again. Young again. Oh, to be young, man. Well, truly, Frazier only saw one pitch, so Elvis wasn't on deck for very long. No. There it is. Single game record for strikeouts as Remillard looks at one. Fewest homers per nine innings in the American League. Oh, don't you have a question that you're supposed to ask and me then too? I, and then I have a question for well, you. Simeon to follow, and it's outside. Garber's really hit the ball. And Joe Kelly's suspension leg. Two and two. Ooh, that one didn't miss wearing dice. <laughs> First pitch is a strike. What's your question? Okay, the question is there. One player, young player, Major League Baseball right now. Yeah, you're going to start your organization. You get one player. He could be up. 
a big pick. He does. Ground ball base hit to Veras, a two strike single. At the end, or perhaps this year. But yeah, Luis, I mean, he's still a very young outfielder, and you could do all. And if Cruz comes back with anything like what he was when he went down for Pittsburgh, commands your pitching staff also. Uh, the catcher. With all of the information available and with. Especially if he's a star. To left field it goes. Benintendi back. He camps just. He beats Otani. The other get a Revo. Oh. Strike two. Yeah, he went. That'll do it. Joe Kelly strikes out a pin. But he did finish the top of the eighth inning. Yeah, you hope that. Drive center field. Benny's got a leadoff of whiff rate. All four, all, all three of his pitches get a swing and miss rate better. Yikes. To left field. Jankowski has come in to play left. 2 0 oh on Robert Jr., and there is Kendall Graveman. This Threw him another slider, and that was the best one by far. Yeah, that was in a perfect spot. Your guess. Ripped to right field. Man, was he on that fastball. On the ground, third base side. Nobody's going to make a play. Foul away on two. He got him with a curveball. Graveman off of him. Kendall is a really self assured guy. He's a very confident guy. Situation for a pitcher. And one of the reasons is that when a pitcher doesn't know that, when it leaves the bat, there's no time. No time. Situation like this. Your heartbeat or your memory. Because I don't care how many times that happens to you. Side straight over my head. Fastball strike three. Nice comeback for Graveman. One down. This ball in. The Sox in the bottom of the nine. You according to Statcast. Minus nine runs. He's taken away nine runs from the. Yep. Problem is the words too. for the slider checked his swing and didn't go three and two base runners all you according to Statcast, minus nine runs he's taken away nine runs from the up yep problem is the words too smoke back he braced for the slider checked his swing and didn't go three and two base runners